so I'm currently in the RV and I'm surrend <laughs> I'm in the bedroom part I don't know if you can see right here in the mirror or not but I have just parts everywhere I have these old outlets that are designed for RVs they're like this and they have this really thin back for for the walls and everything because the walls are only like an inch and three quarters thick between the the frame wall and then the uh, like the whatever this wood is that that's attached so it's only like an inch and like barely two inches so uh, everything nowadays runs off USB power so these outlets aren't really gonna cut it for what I for what everything powers now so I went out and I bought something I don't know where it is somewhere around here but um, I bought a quad quad USB outlet which I'm hoping this will fit over here in the wall uh, because there's a wall outlet over there which is just gonna be four USBs it'll power like my iPad uh, my headset I have a wireless headset um, an additional two additional USB powered anything uh, and then I'm gonna have an alley right here there's an alley right next to my bed as well with this old freaking radio but I'm gonna put a put a different outlet in here which this outlet here is gonna be um, two plugs and two USBs so that way if I have because this is so to speak my side of the bed I guess I don't know. I don't know. I always I sleep on this side. I don't know why. More comfortable, I guess. But so that's my plan for today. Um, these hole, these pre-made holes are really small. They're meant for RV plug-in stuff. And this is I don't even remember what the size of these are. See the width. The width of these boxes are two and a quarter inches. And then the width of the hole is one and three fourths inches so i need to cut out about a half an inch for this box to fit in here uh here's fine because this is just like an open area so i was it's it's small enough what i could do it with a with a handsaw but it was taking too long so i went out and i bought a a small jigsaw it's only 3.5 amps with variable speeds super small super easy to use so I'm gonna finish cutting out this hole with that and hopefully get everything everything mounted up and ready for that to go and I'll be I'll be done with this section the electrical part all right well I finally got this this one box in so it's I had to make some weird cuts but it's finally in so now I'm ready to wire all these up it just I found the outlet as well I found the outlet as well it's gonna go to one of these it's just it's four USBs everything runs off USB now so I'm gonna connect all these up connect it to that we're done yeah. 